In this video, you will learn how to install Android Studio on Ubuntu 20.04 LTS and create and run your first Android application. Let's start download Android Studio from here. I have already downloaded it on my machine and make sure you have installed JDK on your system okay now navigate to download folder and unzip archive file Unpack archive file within user local for your user profile or OPT for shared user. Okay. So move Android Studio to OPT for shared users with this command. okay if you are running on 64 bit version of ubuntu you need to install some 32 bit libraries install this libraries okay now navigate to opt then android studio then bin subdirectory okay to launch Android Studio, now execute Android Studio with this command. Dot slash studio dot SS. Hit enter. No Android SDK found. Before continuing, you must download the necessary components or select an existing SDK. Okay. Select API and select Android SDK location. Now click on next. The Android Studio setup wizard guides you through the rest of the setup, which includes downloading Android SDK components that are required for development. components downloaded and installed now click on finish now you can customize a color theme and id font size and editor font size now create a new project select phone and tablet and then select empty activity now click on next 
now enter the project name and enter the package name okay and select the location where you want to save the project select language java or kotlin okay and select minimum sdk from here okay now click on finish this will take a while for downloading and installing now gradle is configuring the project okay gradle configuring finished now indexing the dependencies and files okay if you see here no device okay open Android virtual device manager from here or you can open it from here and create a new virtual device for running Android application okay select phones and then select big gel then click on next okay now select a system image select the latest system image that is recommended okay and then accept the license term then click on next wait until the installation finishes this will take a while components installed successfully now click on finish okay now click on next now verify the configuration select startup orientation portrait or landscape now click on finish okay select api level and then click on run app to run your android application 